Hi, I'm Jessica with Strider. Today we're gonna cover the learn to stride process on these Strider bikes. The first thing you want to do once you have your bike is adjust it to properly fit your child. Both the handlebars and seat are highly adjustable on a Strider bike for your child that's growing like a weed. We want the child's feet to be flat on the ground and their knees to be slightly bent while sitting on the seat. If the seat is too low, it will cause the child to be uncomfortable and have to work extra hard to stride. If the seat is too high, then the child won't feel confident or stable since their feet aren't firmly planted on the ground. The same goes for the handlebars. We want a slight bend in the elbow while the child is sitting up and holding onto the grips. When you tighten the quick release clamps on your bike after making an adjustment, it's best to use the palm of your hand to firmly press down and close the clamp. The next thing that you wanna do is make sure that you support the child and not the bike. Our first instinct, if your child needs help balancing, is to grab the bike. You don't wanna do that, that doesn't help them at all. If they need help, you can support them on their body, right behind their back. Your child learning to support the weight of the strider is the first lesson in balance. If your child is having trouble getting on and off the bike on their own, try having them step over the frame of the bike while it is laying on the ground, and then lift it between their legs by grabbing onto the handlebar and pulling it up. Some kids may not sit on the seat at first. That's okay. You want to let your child set the pace. Their security is in their feet at this point and we want them to feel secure. As they become comfortable walking with the bike between their legs and using the handlebar, they will soon use the seat. Let them transition at their own pace. They will be striding before you know it. You can help your child enjoy the entire riding experience by mixing it up, taking breaks and making the entire ride an adventure. Every time they push it, pick it up, play with it or ride the bike, it's progress. When your child starts riding their bike, they may only want to spend the first minute or two on their strider. That's okay. Praise them for any amount of time they spend on their strider. The goal is to make the process as enjoyable as possible. Fun is the number one name of the game when teaching your child to ride. So celebrate the small victories. Striding and practicing balance is fun. Even if your child appears to be striding like a pro, moving to a pedal bike too soon can derail progress. Let them continue to practice and perfect their balance and bike handling skills. Don't rush pedaling. Be confident that the time spent on their strider bike will help them easily transition to pedaling when the time is right. With the improved skills they gained, it will be a safer and more enjoyable ride. <laughs>